Good morning. Merry Christmas, everyone. So glad to see you all and have you here. It's a fun Christmas day for TVC Kids. And as we go through our unit studies, we always have action words that go with our unit. So in our Christmas study, we had love like Jesus, proclaim like the angel, listen like Mary. All these action words that go with it. Well, we got to give like the wise men. I loved what one of the students said to me, little Miriam, who's a second grader. I said, you know, you guys probably don't have frankincense and myrrh to give. You may not have a lot of money because you don't have jobs, right? But we could give something else. And Miriam said, we all have a job. And today the kids are going to do their job. Our job is to be kind, to love your neighbor, and to tell people about Jesus. So I love that that came from the voice of our second grader. And um, it's what we're going to do today. Our day today is to tell you the story of Jesus in a very TVC kids kind of way. So are you guys ready? Sing along if you like. was the night of first Christmas, and all through the house, every creature was stirring, yes, even the mouse. The star was hung high over the stable with care, while shepherds and kings said, hey, look over there. For under the star was the true baby king, and all of God's angels that night came to sing. the angel Gabriel. I heard you were coming to hear my story from the stable. My home in heaven has much to tell, but none makes us sing like the story of the baby king. It all started way back when God appointed me messenger to men. I was surprised, and I didn't know what this job would hold. But off I went, just as I was told, to tell the great story about to unfold. First, God sent me to Mary. I got to tell her about the baby she would carry. I am Mary, pretty ordinary. I worship God and help my mom until the day Gabriel came with news of my baby to be, not so ordinarily. Do not be afraid, he said, but all I wanted to do was to hide my head. Still I listened and heard of God's favor as I stood in fear and wonder why he chose ordinary me to mother his extraordinary baby. I am Joseph, the great, 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 great grandson of David the king. Remember David? He was the king who loved to praise and sing. We had heard a savior would come from his family line, but I never thought this would be God's chosen time. Gabriel told me not to worry in a dream, but I was given the honor of being on God's team. So off to Bethlehem we went. Mary, the baby, and me. Oh, the places we would go and the wonder we would see. There was no room at the end, so in a manger he lay. Baby Jesus was born on that first Christmas day. It's dark and I'm lonely out with my sheep in the cold. About the life of a shepherd, there's not much to be told, except on this magnificent night, the sky was filled with heaven's light. God's angel arrived. He was so strong and so bright. I must admit, I was afraid of the sight. 
but the angel said, I bring you good news of great joy. Go to Bethlehem to meet God's baby boy. Then the skies opened wide and angels we found, singing glory to God. What a wonderful sound. As quick as they came, the angels flew from the sky. And I thought to myself, I wonder why God sent angels to me, a shepherd with sheep. My heart was so full, I just could not sleep. So I ran to the stable and fell to my knees. I worshiped the king and he seemed pleased. are the wise men numbered one, two, and three. And we traveled from a land too far away to see. We followed the star because that's what we do and found baby Jesus, coo. But we never expected animals who moo. Some call us wise and some call us kings. But most of the time, all you hear about are the things that we brought to the child so precious and new. He is the king. This much is true. But to us he is more, and we vowed to protect the birth of God's son when Herod would object. So we left on a path no one else knew and would no longer spy for Herod who would bring an end to the life of our new baby friend. We are the wise men numbered one, two, and three. And, and we traveled, traveled from a land too far away to see. Lights, camera, action. Oh, this job brings me such satisfaction. Now, children, you know that each night I shine bright, but never so bright as that cold winter night. As I made my entrance on stage for my show, God had a plan that I didn't know. My costume that day shone brighter than most, as if the director wanted me to host. A night of friends, some big and some small, waiting for them to come one and come all. So they followed my light through all the dark night, till gathered together we bowed at the sight, and I smiled at a light brighter than mine. It was sweet baby Jesus, who forever will shine. He shines for the wise men whose boughs are so deep and even for shepherds so lonely with sheep. He shines for young Mary and girls just like you and Joseph and men whose hearts are kept true. He shines for the hurting, the lost and the weak. He shines for all who are willing to seek his love, his mercy so strong and so true. Whether you're weeping or leaping, he's there for you. He shines for all those willing to say, Merry Christmas in this very special way. <laughs> 